2 Corinthians 1, 3 through 7 reads as follows. All praise to God, the Father of our Lord Jesus Christ. God is our merciful Father and the source of all comfort. He comforts us in all of our troubles so that we can comfort others. When they are troubled, we will be able to give them the same comfort God has given us. For the more we suffer for Christ, the more God will shower us with his comfort through Christ. Even when we are weighed down with troubles, it is for our comfort and salvation. For when we ourselves are comforted, we will certainly comfort you. Then you can patiently endure the same things we suffer. We are confident that as you share in our sufferings, you will also share it in the comfort God gives us. Amen. Listen, beloved, the Apostle Paul wrote these words from his personal experience. He wasn't just trying to gas the people up to keep enduring pain and suffering. He had seen his personal share of suffering over the years, especially for the sake of the gospel of Jesus Christ. Remember, he had been thrown into prison on more than one occasion, but yet still he continued to praise God and share his faith with everyone. He was shipwrecked and abandoned by his former friends. Do you remember that? He was stoned and left for dead. His faith, however, remained firm. Why was that? Because he learned to draw his comfort from the Lord. To be a greater source of comfort for those around you, you have to be able to draw your source of comfort from the Lord. You must understand that whatever we have gone through in life has either been directed or allowed by God. The key is to not waste our pain. We can comfort others with the same comfort that was given to us by God. Amen. And as always, God bless you and God bless you.